Hey, what's going on guys? This is Darius from ArtistShortcut.com and in this video, I want to help you promote whatever it is you want to promote on social media a little bit more effective. So what you see a lot of artists do is that they post a ton of links. So if they drop a new song, they're tagging so-and-so in it and so-and-so in it and so-and-so in it, or they're just, you know, promoting it every single hour. Like, new song, blah, 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 hour pass, new song, blah, 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 hour pass, new song. And you don't want to be one of those artists. So what I recommend you do is to use some type of ratio or or rule for how often you promote your, your music or your merch or whatever it is you're promoting versus how often you engage with people on the actual platform. So like most social networks are meant to be social. Like that's the, the main purpose of it. You want to engage with other people. So what I usually do is I find we have this rule. It's like a, a 80, 20 rule, right? Where it's 20% of the work you do yields 80% of the 80% of the results and 80% of the work you do yields 20% of the, the results. Like it's just, it's that, that ratio where there's a small percentage of things that you do that brings in the, the biggest gain for you. So what I recommend you do is use a ratio like that. I usually go by the 80, 20 rule on most things just cause it makes it easier for me to remember and things like that. And I don't mean you need to like sit there and write these things down. Like I talked to three people. Now it's time to promote music. I need to hurry up and talk to three more people so I can promote my music. Like you don't want that. And, um, yeah, you want to use some type of rule, right? So it's like 80% of the time you talk to people, you're engaging, you're connecting, and then 20% of the time you promote whatever it is that you want to promote. And that should keep you from looking like one of those artists that's trying too hard. Like you don't want to try to look like, you don't want to look like you're trying to be an artist. You want to be an artist. You want people to think you are an artist, not that you're trying to be an artist. And those are two completely different things because one will get you a lot of fans and the other will just get you a bunch of people saying, oh yeah, that song is cool. Like, yeah, keep doing what you're doing. You're doing great. Like, just make good music. Like, those are the type of people that one of those will attract, and you don't want that. So, I definitely recommend you split the amount of uh, like promotional material into whatever that ratio is, whether it be 20%, 30%, 40%, whatever that is, and then just uh, put the informational type of content into one category and, and do that. Just split it between 100%. And one's 20, one's 80, or one's 30, one's 70, one's 40, one's 60, and so on. So guys, that's one of the tips that I have if you want to promote your music or whatever it is a little bit more effectively without diluting your brand and looking like you're just another person trying to be an artist. So please, thumbs up the video, subscribe, and uh, you guys know the, the drill. If you have any questions, leave a comment below, and I'll try to help out as much as possible. And until next video, I am out.